So, Johnny, Martin of France is the referee. This 92 kilogram heavyweight contest is in the third preliminary round. And it's between boxes from Kazakhstan and Uzbekistan. The boxer wearing red, who has just taken a hard right hand to the body, is Ibek Oralbay. Boxer wearing blue is Uzbekistan's Madiyal Sidrakhimov, 24 years of age, second bout of the tournament for both of these boxers, who are both appearing in their first senior world boxing championships. Although Oral Bai was an outstanding youth classification boxer. In 2018, he took World Youth Silver as he gets through with a right hand to the to the head of his opponent. As well as that World Youth Silver, he took 2018 Youth Olympic grounds and he runs his man onto a south onto a beautiful right hand. Single shot success. Side Rakimov smiling in the direction of the referee. There's the right uppercut. That rock the head back of Saeed Rakimov. World Series boxing experience from the man in blue who's just driven a hard right hand into the body. Three-time national champion of Uzbekistan claimed World Boxing Military Championships gold two years ago, the soldier in the Uzbekistan army. So a minute to go in the opening round. A standing count has been issued against Said Rakimov after he was walked onto a beautiful right hand from Oral Bay. Right hand over the top wasn't too far away from Said Rakimov. Oh, that's a solid right hand from the Uzbekistan boxer wearing blue. It's coming close together there. Accuracy just decreasing as both men are looking for big singles from beyond punching range. Right hand from Said Rakimov missed by some distance. Nice rabbit punches being exchanged between the two of them. 2 1 in favor of Said Rakimov. My goodness, they were blatant fouls. So, first round in the book. For my money, it's Oral Bai who took that first three-minute frame. So Oral Bai taking it on a 4-1 split. Saeed Rakimov, his work preferred on the scorecard of the judge from Egypt. Some of the action then from the opening round. And that was the success enjoyed. First with a long left and then the right uppercut. Smiling his way through the count was Said Rakimov. But he took a count nonetheless. So into the second round then. Madiyar Said Rakimov was a unanimous point decision victor over Vladislav Smialikov of Belarus. The Tokyo Olympic quarter finalist flurry of punches, including a right hook dislodges the mouthpiece of Said Rakimov. It's retrieved by our referee. Oral Bay will be sent to the neutral corner. And it will have to be rinsed and reinserted. So now the referee will go through the procedure of having his hands disinfected inside those latex gloves. 
remember if that mouthpiece continues to come out it could well result in a point deduction for Said Rakimov oh that's a good right hand to the body left hook upstairs and then a right hand again good burst of success for Said Rakimov best punches of the round landed by the man in blue Left hook landed with the crook of the elbow from Said Rakimov. Rabai looking for his lead left hand. Clipping left hook landed by the Uzbekistan boxer wearing blue. A nice left jab on the back foot from Orelbay. Now up on his toes, looking to box beyond distance. Driven to the ropes, and as he was, the dramatic layback, which was accentuated by a clipping shot, sees Orelbay take a standing count. Approaching the midpoint of the second round. Orelbay doesn't appear to be too badly hurt, but Said Rakimov senses that he may well be and sets about his man and scores with a solid left jab. Oh, he was winging away with another jab. Oralbay was trying to counter downstairs to catch the man he was, he was coming in. On the resumption, it's a spearing right hand to the body from side Rakimov. Oralbay, after going on his toes and taking a standing count when he was near the ropes, now getting to, trying to get back on the front foot. Oralbay, the busier boxer through these first two minutes of round number two. Excuse me, Said Rakimov, the man in blue, is the busier boxer. And I wonder whether Orelbay, just feeling the pace a little bit, takes another left hook. Now he's beyond punching range, trying to time his man with a lead left hand. But while he's in close quarters, he takes another left hook and then a solid right hand, which results in a swing and a miss from Orelbay. There's another right cross. Terrific response in what is a very good round from Said Rakimov. And Orelbay has got to go in pursuit of some payback here. Because his punch output is slowed, he's being outworked, he's being outpunched, outscored. With only 25 seconds remaining in the round. Counter right hand is a more effective shot again from Said Rakimov. Remember, he conceded the first on a 4-1 split after he was issued with a standing count. Not that that often affects the scorecards in Aiba boxing but he really did turn the tables for my money against Ibek Oralbay in that second round man's punch output reduced and he was hit by some solid shots mainly singles but there was the burst of activity to both body and head from Said Rakimov which I think yes indeed it sees him take it across the board so we've got four scorecards of 19 points apiece. One scorecard favoring Said Rakimov by 20 points to 18 on judge number three's card, the judge from Egypt. But a really impressive response from Said Rakimov. There was the burst of success to both body and head. And that's the shot that brought the standing count. Trying to employ the layback when against the ropes by the, by the time the shot reached him, it looked terrible from Oralbay's point of view. So we're going to the third and final round then, and this contest is in the balance. We have four scorecards that are tied 19 points apiece after two completed rounds, and it's an altogether more aggressive start from Ibek Oralbay, three-time national champion of Kazakhstan. Takes a left hook and then a right hand around the corner. He slams back with a right uppercut with the inside of the glove. 30 seconds gone in the third and final round. And this battle of reigning national champions has absolutely nothing in it for four of the five judges. One round apiece, 19 points apiece with 16 minutes in the book. But Oralbay, notably trying to get onto the front foot in this third and final round after electing to go on the back foot in the second round that's where he was pinned on the ropes and then after that point well he was outworked by Said Rakimov so what will both of the boxers be able to summon up here with a minute and change gone in the third round 
Oral Bai onto the front foot. A clinch ensues. So both boxers spoken to about the infringement of the rules that they committed. Oh, there's plenty of commitment from both men. But who can produce some quality? There's a left hook and then a left hand followed by a right hand. Another left from side Rakimov and then a crashing right hand onto the head of Oral Bai. Shots without reply because Oral Bai wasn't able to find a range with his attempted counters. Coach Drew left was short to the mark. Oral Bai coming forward but off the mark with the jab. So closing seconds, and Oral Bai, for my money, has landed the better work as he, on a resumption, he scores with a left jab. He's got the lead hand, hand out and the right hand cocked, but as he was coming forwards, he ran into a couple of lead lefts, did Oral Bai. So what can he do, the man in red? Takes another left jab as his right hand is off the mark. Uppercut was a big punch attempted by Oral Bai. See, he's fed another left hand once again by Said Rakimov. He scores with the right hand to the body, Oral Bai, during that exchange. Somebody's mouthpiece has come out, I believe. Free swinging conclusion to this contest, which saw Oral Bai end it without his gum shield. I happen to think that the man in blue Madiar Said Rakhimov has done enough to take that final round in a contest that was all square, 19 points apiece for judges 1, 2, 4 and 5 after 6 minutes of boxing. Now in the event that we have tied scores, we will go to preference which will be indicated by an asterisk if that is indeed what transpires. Remember, you need an absolute majority of the three scoring judges. 2-0, the 2-1 is not enough. Both boxers think they've done enough. But how will the judges have scored this one? Here's the verdict. And there is confirmation of a split decision victory for Uzbekistan in this fiercely contested rivalry against their Central Asian neighbors. Incredibly close contest, four scorecards of 28-29, but it's Madiar Said Rahimov who takes it on a 4-1 split. What a turnaround because he conceded the first round 4-1 after taking account rallied magnificently in the second